hope we can last until Dashie and Pearl get back here. What do you mean, Nighty? Look at it. It's rock solid. Maybe solid enough for that wave, but they keep getting bigger. Octonauts, race the barrier. <laughs> I hope Gashi gets here soon. What in the world is happening? The storm we were trying to warn you about. It's finally hit, Katie. Oh dear, we hate storms. Always have, always, always will. They've come up with a new strategy, but will it work? It will be an uphill battle. Uh oh, there's a slippery hazard up ahead. Good thing you didn't sleep on that banana peel. Come on, guys, you can do it. Don't give up. Was a little encouragement. Uh oh, oh, too much encouragement. Looks like we gotta run away. Oh, what's all the commotion? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. The runaway is making a comeback! <laughs> Goal! Oh, what happened? The little guys planted their tree! With a little help from your holes! Oh, glad I could help! Good day, Vegemals. We were wondering if you could use some help. Well, at least we can help you fix up the chair up five. Well done, Vegemals. Once again, we can have Coco to go with our morning kelp cake. <laughs> what? No kelp cakes? Looks like we're out of kelp. <laughs> All right, Coco will do. Help! Ahoy! What's wrong? My baby, Nico! A wave pulled him right off my back! Yow! Looks like the little nipper got caught in a rip current! 
But, but I thought pygmy sloths were strong swimmers. We carry our babies everywhere we go for more than a year. Nico isn't ready to swim on his own yet. Then we've got a pygmy sloth to rescue. Come on, Grandad. <laughs> Sloth low! Hmm? Sounds like a tasty treat. Good news! Nico made it to the shore! <gasps> Bad news! There's a hungry jaguar on that shore! Hang on, Grandad! We need to save that shaggy sea! I mean, baby sloth! Look like a fish. Uh oh. Keepa, keepa, ready, man. Hello, let's go. Look at this. I think you may have made a mistake. We're not tasty morsels. We're octonauts. You look plenty tasty to me. Safety. I want my mama. Don't worry, little matey. We'll have your home before you know it. <laughs> uh oh, the Vegemals can't set sail when they got no sail to set. <laughs> Help save you! Thanks, Sloths, for lending a hand. Or even three toes. This could take a while. Maybe I can squeeze through that gap in the rocks. Okay, Peso. But be careful. <laughs> oh no. This looks like a dead end. Don't think I can move this rock. Wow! I'm stronger than I thought. Oh, I suppose it was you who moved that rock, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hi, so you're here. And this must be Kato. I'm Peso, and I'm here to help. Now hold still. There. Is that better? Yes. I can stand now. <sighs> That's one problem solved, but we still need to find a way out. Gemma and I could scout for another exit. But hey, where's Gemma? I'll use my wonder cam to search the caves. We'll find Gemma, I promise. Come on, Gemma. Where are you? <gasps> Found her! Gemma, are you okay? Oh, hello. I'm fine. I hoped I would find the way out for everyone and prove what a good leader I could be. But I did not. <laughs> Maybe you did. Mmm, these air currents smell fresh. Must be coming from outside. Mm -hmm. The air's coming from that way. Oi! There's an opening! And I hear rushing water outside. Hey, Gemma. Looks like you found a way out after all. Assuming we can widen it. Leave that to us. This should be much easier than trying to dig through the cave-in. Elephants, form a trunk brigade. <laughs> You're leading us back to the cave, but we'll be trapped. Don't worry, I have a plan. 
I've got a joke for you now. What has four ears, two tails, an eye patch, and a sock puppet? Our oh, dinner! What's <laughs> that? <laughs> Who cares? Run! I think that did the trick, Captain. Let's get out of here. There must be an easier meal out there somewhere. I'm sticking to this tree no matter what. I'm afraid we can't go anywhere either. Our egg is about to hatch, so I sealed up our nest to keep them safe. Them? Are you saying Mrs. Hornbill is sealed inside there too? Only for five months? Just until our chick is old enough to fly? It's not so bad. There's a little hole where I bring them food. But they're not going anywhere for now. We can't risk harming the Hornbills. Looks like we'll have to move this tree upright. <laughs> I can use my map to lead you on the smoothest path to the safest location, just across the river. Excellent. Wazi and I will stay behind to make sure a teeth doesn't follow you. Careful around the roots, Tweak! Whoa! Careful! Sorry about that, Mrs. Hornbill. We'll be fine. Just as soon as we make it across that rope bridge. Hey! Where'd my scratching tree go? Now, Atif, I'm sorry, but the creatures in that tree were in danger, so we had to move it. Plenty more trees in the forest, matey. We can help you find one, like this one. Sleek, stylish, a real itch scratcher. But I want my scratching tree. <sighs> hey! Come back with that. <sighs> That's it, Tweak. Slow and steady. Yes, steady is good. Please be careful. My wife and chick are inside. Uh, I can do the slow part. I'm not so sure about steady. <laughs> oh, no, no. Forget slow. A teeth is right on our tail. Hold on, a teeth. Let me pass. That's my scratching tree. No can do, matey. There are creatures in that snag. Oh no! Tweak, open the hatch! Barnacles. I like to go with the flow. Above and beyond.